right, it's Sunday, November 14th. Um, tonight I had a follow-up video um, with the FDMI hazmat option or, or operation truck near the vent that I had pointed out to them. Um, it's a Sunday. I'm still within this. I'm the backs against the wall and I'm in a blind in also a uniquely deaf situation. So Lewis asks me, I'm going for my walk, it's raining. Lewis asks me to pick this up for him. This you buy in the store with money, US dollars, um, or US money, currency of some sort. Mama Mia! Uh, shh. This, he says, the humans tell him, he sees it on commercials, and the other humans tell him that this helps your memory, your short and long term memory. Um, this is called a vitamin or a supplement. So that's V I T A M E N or S U P P L E M E N T. This is the stuff after they hurt your human. This is like extra taxes added in in secret coded ways. This is dangerous. My memory should not... I pay regular taxes. I pay sales taxes. Um, when I had money and I was working, I paid state and federal taxes through that. Why is it that my memory is not my own and not fully functioning? Why do I then have to buy with my own money these. That's what my father should be asking, but he doesn't. On top of this type of magic, magic pill that the humans force upon one another and sell one another to continue this, this system breakage and dysphoria with amnesia and, um, it's like dyslexia, honestly, uh, then they have this type of medicine, which is, you must, this one, though, is a different form of health care. Like, you have to go book an appointment with a doctor who's a body machina doctor, but uh, actually, no, I'm sorry. He's just, there's some form of practicing medicine. They, they have initials MD on there, whatever. They're not physicians of anything health dynastic related. So now you have to make an appointment with them. Then they prescribe to you some magical disease you have. Then they push you into a magical prescription plan. And then it's like you never get out of it. But it's the most... You don't know what this is made out of. There's no ingredients. There's just some mad, there's some pharmaceutical name. And this is the lifestyle that they force you in while your body is breaking worse and more young. And it's due to the weather, the atmospheric pressures and patterns. They never get to the root cause of the problem of what's broken that you that I'm living through. It feels like they do a whole lot of bread and circus and diagnostics and then cover up on the tell a vision that comes through as some kind of advertisement acknowledgement. But the people, being myself at this point and my four children, watching these things, we didn't cause the problem. We're not benefiting from the problem. And I don't know how to fix the problem because I got no voice and I've got no way out of this, this disgusting cycle and broken system. So now Lewis says, could you buy this for me? This, the health insurance for New York State covers. So this was only a dollar. So it didn't come out of my pocket. It came out of the state's pocket for Medi Medicare, Medicaid, one of those. I don't know. Because I have no money. This one, Lewis pays out of pocket. On t he takes this stuff, which he pays... He's got a different health plan. I have no idea because they actually make money or some peanuts money. And then I have 
then he wants to buy this. This was $62.99, I think. Almost six, almost $65 was sales tax and whatever. Maybe a little bit more. Why, when you already take the extortionist's magic to protect yourself and your family and your body so it doesn't break so horrifically and disgusting in the broken outer system, why are you forced then, in order to have your memory and be able to function on a biologically decent scale, do you then have to come out of pocket to buy your short-term memory back with some new form of magic that they're forcing in something called a supplement or a vitamin is, industry is benefiting? This is called prescription. P-E-R-S-C-R-I-P-T-I-O-N. It sounds like per, P-E-R, per person who, I mean, it goes into some fund, and then, I mean, it feels like that's how they vacation and take advantage of everybody and the system even more in writing my, me out and my children out of the current demographic area and territory. But I can't get out because they have me locked in and trapped here under misinformation, like misdiagnosis, mis- like, I can't, education, I mean, and then the corruption and the cover-up. I mean, it's just, it's amazing just how disgusting and disorienting living here has been. Star one night, and not on top, and then on top of that, the punishment. I'm limp, first of all, I've gained so much weight, even though I exercise. I've gained so much weight just moving across the border from Suffolk into the city. And then, uh, uh, not only did I take on interstitial plasmodic weight, but that I can't seem to drop, and it just keeps getting worse, and I don't really eat or drink that much, um, not substantially, and I'm moving, then I've got limps, I, L-I-M-P-S, on my knees I, and my hips. I, sh I have never had an injury. I've never had, like, a sports, any, there's no reason why... I should have any orthopedic pain whatsoever, or musculature pain. There's no valid reason for this other than complete neglect and disregard for the health of a human inside of some subset system that's under attack or under centrifuge being misdiagnosed and kept quiet while well, everybody is being harmed in some way. I have no idea what the real diagnosis is. I'm stuck here and I'm being harmed while I'm also part of the mechanics that need to get to special area. As T S T F M S B. It's either special blend, special bland, special blend, some kind of S B. Star 1978, Star 8378, Nicole Caterosa. It's Earth, Solar System, Milky Way, Universe, Galaxies, Broken, and Space Light Station, Base Light, New York, 11361.